Welcome to Geopolitical Horizon. Today I want to reflect on US sanctions policy and how it's driving China's rise and strengthening China's geopolitical space. So over the years, we've seen US sanctions being imposed on a range of countries. Uh, the two clearest examples now, I think, are US sanctions towards Russia and Iran. Now, what is happening, we're seeing how, for example, China and Iran signed a 25-year strategic agreement earlier this year. That's going to drive relationship between China and Iran into the future. We're also seeing how Russia and China now strengthen their strategic partnership and they're collaborating more and more in a range of fields, financially, economically, within energy, industrial space, infrastructure connections, and also military and defense collaboration. So US sanctions policy actually has an inadvertent consequence of driving China's rise and strengthening China's geopolitical space. What surprises me is that no US advisors or strategists or journalists or analysts seem to see this. And that's really surprising because a lot of US analysts and journalists, you know, criticize China and you know talk about how the US could position itself in competition and really should you know kind of push China and, and Russia but what they don't seem to see is actually how US sanctions policy now creates the opposite effect of what I imagine they would like because I think that you know US strategists and consecutive US governments want US sanctions to you know make countries change their policies but that's not happening. Uh, we haven't seen that yet. So therefore, the US sanctions policy now over the years just strengthen China's rise and increase China's geopolitical space where it actually can just build its relations. It can you know, build infrastructure, develop trade uh, relationships, strengthen economic leverage, you know, build a lot of connectivity that is just strengthening China's position globally. So therefore, US sanctions policy continues to have an inadvertent effect in actually then strengthening China's rise going forward. So I think looking at this from a larger picture, what is important is to really look at the effects of US sanctions. What are the consequences of US sanctions? You know, people in government in various countries they are not going to want to just strengthen relations with the U.S. when they're imposed sanctions on their, their countries. They're going to look for other partners. They're going to look for other alliances, other partnerships. And I think that is important to be aware of. And that, that they don't seem to think about this in various foreign policy circles within the U.S. And I think that continues to be a challenge for the United States because it's contributing to China's rise over the years. I think U.S. sanctions policy is going to continue towards Iran and towards Russia and other countries. The U.S. Uh, government has even you know, talked about maybe imposing sanctions on Turkey and India for wanting to buy the S-400 defense system from Russia. So we're seeing now how U.S. sanctions can even be imposed on what should be U.S. allies. So, and I think this is interesting looking at a larger picture. But thank you so much for joining. I look forward to see you again. Now, please remember to subscribe to Geopolitical Horizon. Thank you.